But before this charity is provided, we must ask your assistance on a strange matter which has befallen Messonicia, a matter in which only you can be of assistance. The honor of his house is at stake. How can I help? I'm not sure if you know Camilo Calfucci, Messer Nietzsche's nephew. Yes, I do. He went to France on business a year ago, and as he is a widower, he left his marriageable daughter mm -hmm. in the care of a certain convent. And what happened? What happened was that either through negligence on the nun's part or the girl's frivolity, she is now four months pregnant. So that if this matter is not handled with prudence, we shall see Messer Nietzsche, the girl, the nuns, Camillo and the whole house of Calfucci disgrace. <laughs> Messer Nietzsche is so apprehensive about this matter that he has vowed to give 300 ducats for the love of God if this matter is dealt with. That will be the day. Will you be quiet? <laughs> and he wishes the donation to pass through your hands. You and the abbess are his only hope. Oh, how can I be of assistance? You must persuade the abbess to have the girl drink a potion that will make her miscarry. Look, I shall have to give the matter some thought. Why? Uh, do you need to? Think of all the good that will arise out of this. You will maintain the honor of the convent, the girl, and the family. You will give a father his daughter back, please Messer Nietzsche and all his relatives, and do as much charitable good as the 300 ducats will allow. And all the while you shall harm nothing but a bit of unborn, unfeeling flesh that could be eliminated in a thousand different ways. I believe that that is good, which does the greatest amount of good, and makes the most number of people happy. So be it in the name of God, I shall do as you propose. Mm. Let it all be done for God and charity. Now, tell me the name of the convent, give me the potion, and if you like, the money too, so we can start doing some good. Now, I see you are the kind of friar that I believed you to be. Mm -hmm. 